innovation as a growth strategy, uh, I think, is here to stay. If we look at um, macro strategies that have been deployed to drive growth over the last 20 or 30 years, um, globalization is obviously a, um, a big lever that organizations have been able to pull to deliver top-line growth. Um, quite simply, I'm having success in one market, I take what I have uh, from a products and services standpoint and I sell it to new markets. Uh, and that allows me to exploit growth simply by expanding geographically. Um, but for many of our large organizations, uh, that's done. I mean, we've, we've essentially tapped out the markets that we can access. We're selling our products to everybody that uh, we can. And so while that was a phenomenal growth strategy for, for decades, um, it's nearing the end of its useful life for many of our large organizations. Uh, similarly, uh, the other macro strategy that we've deployed over the last 30 years to, to improve bottom line results is investing in efficiencies. Whether it's re-engineering, lean, Six Sigma, outsourcing, um, you know, we've stripped the fat out of, out of our organizations to the point where um, arguably that strategy is reaching the end of its natural life. Uh, and so M&A you know, becomes another source of growth but when everybody is in the M&A game, um, you're bidding up asset prices and returns on that strategy are diminished. So what are you left with? I mean, you're gonna have to reevaluate your ability to innovate and create new products and services. Um, and so I think that is the, the driver behind the um, ascendancy of the chief innovation officer role and the investment that organizations are making. The challenge I see is while we might have reached the conclusion that we need to grow from innovation and we have assigned accountability to a new executive for that strategy, we have yet to actually do all of the things that will allow them to be successful. Um, we haven't re fundamentally reevaluated our functional organizational structures. We haven't reevaluated the uh, incentive systems that might run counter uh, to enabling growth from innovation. And the chief innovation officer uh, is quickly going to run into barriers if they don't take stock, prepare, uh, and really understand the challenges that lay before them.